Two. Inside, Inside the igloo. igloo. This is season two brought to you by This Fall Seniors. We have Clay Rager, Justin Reffitt, Carter Curtis, Cooper Thomas, McKenna Ivoin, and Skylar Bishop. I'm here with fellow teammate Rowan Freighter, defensive end. You play really well on defense. Um, can you explain a little bit how you perform so well? Well, I'll show you. All right. Dude, 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 seriously? <laughs> yeah. Is it going to three, two, let's go. It's Gundy! It's Gundy! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are here with our new principal, Mr. Kaufman. So um, how's it feel coming to Hard Northern? Actually, I love Hard Northern so far. A lot of great kids in here, a lot of good energy this year. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to having a great year. So I'm glad to be here. Yeah. And tomorrow we have a game against Arlington. What's um, How do you feel about that? Well, I can tell you right now, there's a lot of good energy in this building. The guys are getting ready to go. And uh, I'm just going to say it right now, the A's are taped on the walls and they stand no chance against the Polar Bears. All right, and final question, what would your score prediction be for tomorrow night? 34-17, good guys. Go Bears. We are here with our mystery guest. Um, so what's your uh, score prediction on tomorrow night's game? I think it will be Harden Norton 38, Arlington 17. I think the key moment will be a fumble recovery touchdown by the legendary Clay Rager. Some bold predictions. I like it. I'm here with Rowan Freyer. Okay, how are you feeling about tomorrow's game, Rowan? Oh, I'm going crazy. I'm pumped. I'm here with Senior Carter Curtis. Do you have a quote for this football season? Oh, yeah. Like uh, Coach Cooper always says, once a Cooper, always a Cooper. Okay, I'm here with Sean Coleman. <laughs> what are your predictions for this season? Uh, we're going to go 10-0 and 0 in the season, and then we're going to win all the games in the playoffs, and we're going to be state champs. Okay, I'm here with quarterback Nolan Hobson. What's your score prediction? 35-14. And how are you feeling about this game? I'm excited. I'm ready to go. Go Bears. Okay, I'm here with Clay Rager. What are your game predictions for tomorrow? I'm going to say it's about to be 28-23, uh, to Harden Northern. Justin, what about you? 35-14, to Harden Northern. And Carter? 42, nothing, Harden Northern. Rowan, what about you? 21 and nothing, Harden Northern. Cooper? 24-21, Harden Northern. And Sean? 48, nothing, Harden Northern. I am here with... Catherine, Ann, Heidi. All right, so you guys have a volleyball game Saturday against Macomb, right? Mm -hmm. How do you feel that game's going to go? Um, I think we're going to do pretty good. I think we'll win in maybe three or four. All right, and Ann, can you give me like a score prediction? I'll say 3-0, and 25-20-ish. All right, and then you guys have a long season ahead of you. So, Heidi, how do you feel uh, your record's going to be? I definitely think we're coming out with the winning record. I think we're going to be 15-7 and seven or something like that. All right, that's... Sounds pretty good. Good luck, ladies. This is how you sneak into somewhere in the room. How do you feel this weekend's uh, volleyball game is going to go, Miss Satter? So, Miss Satter, this weekend you have a volleyball game against Macomb. How do you think it's going to go? No, it's talking to you. Good answer. It's a good answer. Hello, I'm here with Calvin. How is your first week of school going? Good. Good. My favorite what? My favorite subject is math. His favorite subject's math. With Joseph. And how's your first week of school so far? It's pretty good because I finally get to do choir again. Anything special? Anything happened this week so far? And not much because it's just beginning week, but it's been kind of chill. Good answer. I'm here with sixth grader 
Kyle Curtis. So, um, how's your first week of school going? Good. That's all you have to say? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm here with our new act teacher, Mr. Westone. How do you feel about Hardin Northern? Uh, so far, I'm really enjoying it. Everybody seems pretty excited, and I'm pretty excited to be here, too. That's awesome. How do you feel like your past few days have went since we recently just started school? Uh, it's been kind of a blur, but in a good, exciting way. It's nice to put faces to names and actually be able to get out and meet my students. I love that. Okay, one last question. How do you feel like our first FFA chapter meeting went for 2023-2024 school year? Uh, I think every first meeting there's going to be a couple of bumps along the way, but overall I'm really happy with the attendance um, and I'm looking forward to many more. Thank you so much. I'm here with this year's 2023-2024 FFA President. Cooper, how did you feel about our first meeting? I, it was kind of shaky at some parts, but we got what we needed to do, get done, you know. So I think it was successful in the end. Okay, did you, would you say you had fun? Yeah, I did. I had lots of fun. <laughs> That's great. Bodie, what's this here? I whoop, you're whooping up on Sean in basketball. Well, me and my teammate Justin Reffa against the two best players on the high school basketball team are up 12 to 4 right now. We're whooping tail. How many dunks do you have? Four. Four? Well, you heard it, kids. What's today? Heidi Troxel. How would you say that your cornhole skills are? I'm going to say probably a negative five. I am really bad. You would think so? Yeah, I would think so. And well, I've been told by other people that I'm really bad and I should just stay away. But, you know, I'm here. <laughs> Let's see. That is it for this week's of Inside the Igloo. Make sure you tune in next week so when we have volleyball and football highlights. See you then.